Uh, all right, here we go again. It's hot for many of us again. Uh, for Monday, we might as well just get flipped on the grill. We had 17 more locations post daily record highs. This time, a couple of hundreds getting into the mix. 102 in Pierce, South Dakota. You were the hottest record high to kick off the week on Monday. Not the best first impression of the new week. And we got still plenty more heat to go around for the central and eastern United States. Highs 80s, 90s, 100s, many well above averages. And we'll rewrite the record books again for many locations again. For today, portions of south, southern and southwest Texas, the, New York, uh, the Philadelphia metro area, Hartford, Providence, Boston, Minneapolis, all have heat advisories today. Take precautions because of the heat. Grab shade, drink as much water as you need. Don't leave cat, uh, kids or pets in the back seat of the car, please, even for a minute. Elevated a critical wildfire threat for La Las Vegas area, most of Utah and the western Colorado. Wildfire threats are out there and a quick drought update just continues to get worse for drought conditions out west and areas of North Dakota. Exceptional drought is relatively widespread in those areas, and that's the highest level of uh, classification for drought monitoring that we have. So it is still going to be very drought stricken, I think, in the long term forecast there. A couple areas of severe weather, slight risk, meaning scattered severe storms are likely bordering Montana, Wyoming, and the Dakotas and surrounding areas. Large hail damaging winds might get a tornado or two later this afternoon and potentially ahead of a trough of low pressure. Some arcing thunderstorms, isolated severe weather, mainly damaging winds. Memphis included in that dark green shade, so potentially a hot, muggy, and stormy forecast for a lot of the lower 48 again and watching for more heavy rain from Little Rock, Arkansas to areas of the Ohio, Tennessee River Valley for the next few days. One to three inches, locally heavy amounts of rain, certainly possible. Augusta, Georgia picked up nearly five inches of rain. Easily good enough for a daily record for you yesterday. But of course, right along the Mississippi, Ohio, Tennessee River Valleys, we'll watch for that chance of storms.